Charlie, the defending D3 state champs Notre Dame will be making their fourth appearance in a state football title game on Friday. But this one will have special significance. After leading the Tritons for 27 years, John Nowak will coach his final game on the biggest stage. And there's nothing his players would like more than to give their coach a storybook ending. We were all hoping for this season to go this well, but um, our main goal is just to send out co send coach out right and have a good season for him. I think it would just be quite the honor because he's done so much for our school and the football program. I think he deserves something like this to go out with. We just prepared as usual and said, you know, with our last game together, what a great opportunity to play maybe one of the best teams in the state of Wisconsin. But I'm sure it'll settle in sometime. For even more inspiration, the players had the chance to practice at the Don Hudson Center on Wednesday night. It's kind of neat to watch the first timers walk in and they're always looking at the ceiling, you know, and stuff like that. Just to see like all those banners up there and just be in the facilities that it's like my favorite team growing up. So it's just kind of really cool to be around it. The Tritons will be facing a familiar foe. Catholic Memorial, who Notre Dame beat last year in the title game, will return for a rematch. Undefeated champion of the Classic Eight, which a lot of people think is the best conference in the state of Wisconsin. So we got our work cut out for us. I want to win really bad. It'd be really cool to be back to back state champions and not let them get their revenge on us from last year. Well, I already know we're bringing a trophy home, and we sure hope it's the gold one. So Notre Dame going for back-to-back -back state titles. And another area team, Kimberly, hoping to make it a four-peat. We'll have a preview of the Papermakers championship match at 10. Charlie?